హలో స్టూడెంట్స్ వెల్కమ్ టు మై ఛానల్ మేరీ మేడం టెక్ క్లాసెస్ టుడే వీ ఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు కంటిన్యూ ఫ్రమ్ ద సేమ్ చాప్టర్ స్టాటిస్టిక్స్ ద టాపిక్ ఈజ్ సిమ్సన్స్ పారడాక్స్ వాట్ ఈస్ సిమ్సన్స్ పారడాక్స్ సిమ్సన్స్ పారడాక్స్ ఇస్ ఏ స్టాటిస్టికల్ ఫినామినా వేర్ అన్ అసోసియేషన్ బిట్వీన్ టూ వెరియబుల్స్ ఇన్ ఏ పాపులేషన్ దట్ ఎమర్జర్స్ డిసప్పియర్స్ ఆర్ రివర్సర్స్ వెన్ ద పాపులేషన్ ఈజ్ divided into sub populations according to the data science simpson paradox uh, one of the analyzing data is simpson's paradox in which correlations can be misleading when confounding variables are ignored what is confounding variable means it is a confounding variable is a third variable that influences both the dependent and independent if you want to decide to examine which course data scientists are friendlier if we say here west coast and east coast west coast one out one members east coast one out three members west coast one out one members average friends is 8.2 East Coast, 103 members. Average friends is 6.5. Here, it certainly looks like the West Coast data scientists are friendlier than the East Coast data scientists. If you look only at people with the PhDs, the East Coast data data scientists have more friends on average than the west coast and if you look at the people without phd's the east coast data scientists also have more friends on average when compared to west coast if you see here with phd's without a phd is with a phd is and without phd is the average friends is more when compared to west coast data scientists once you account for the users degrees the correlation goes in the opposite direction bucketing the data as east coast or west coast distinguish with the fact that the east coast data scientists skew much more heavily toward phd types this phenomenon crops up in the real world with some regularity the key issue is that correlation is measuring the relationship between your two variables all else being equal if your data classes are assigned at random as they might be in a well designed experiment all else being equal might not be a terrible assumption but when there is a deeper pattern to class assignments all else being equal can be an awful assumption the only real way to avoid this is by knowing your data and by doing what you can to make sure you have checked for possible confounding factors obviously this is not always possible if you did not have data on the educational attainment of these 200 data scientists you might simply conclude that there are something inherently more sociable about the west coast Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel Mary Madam Tech Classes. Click on the bell symbol. You will get all my videos in the form of notification. Thank you once again for watching this video. We will meet in another video. Till then, bye. Take care.